it was also opening day for Keeneland's spring meet, where it was all about the first yesterday, starting on a Thursday for the first time in some 60 years. It was also the first time Central Bank's Thursday Night Live kicked off their season at Keeneland. Here's a look at the action. Excitement was in the air Thursday for Keeneland's opening day. This race, we come here every year. And this year, the spring meet opening a day earlier. We wanted to come because this weekend is going to be so crowded. So we thought with today, but it's still a good crowd here. I love it. I love it. We started to come to college day tomorrow, but we figured we was too old for that. Of course, there was plenty of betting. Some winning. Others just here for the fun. My friend and I cashed one <laughs> ticket in. So, you know, we lost maybe a total of three dollars, maybe. So we're doing great. Better than the casinos. Because we go to the casinos a lot, so <laughs> add in a few signature drinks. Put it together. For a recipe for success. One strawberry. And the weather held up, drawing in huge crowds for day one, some for the fashion. I love it so much. I think it's so cute. And I think like everywhere should be like this. But most for the love of horses. They're really pretty. I really like them a lot. And Central Bank's Thursday Night Live also taking place at Keeneland last night for the first time, putting a wrap on opening night. <laughs> Erica Bivens, ABC 36 News. And Thursday Night Live returns to its regular location in downtown Lexington next Thursday through October 10th. You can view a complete list of post drawings on those races on our website, WTVQ.com.